let's go scary let's go well which comes very handy while this is basically where i live this is like my best friend in the house so we can see the world trade center view from here hello welcome back to another video so in today's vlog i will show you where i live and i'll give you an accommodation tour and uh, basically give you my home tour and also show you my room and everything that i have in my house i know this video has been pending from like a very long time so i thought let's just do it so this is basically where i live this is my building which has a two bed one bath apartments and it's a three floor building and we live on the third floor and uh, so this is the entrance it needs a key to get in so yeah let's get in the house so after we come inside there's always packages here like amazon walmart all the packages are dropped here and they have like a special key where even if we are not home they can still enter this is like the letter boxes and if you have letters or cards i'm not going to show you inside because it's of everyone in the building hi come so yes so this is my house i'm going to show you step by step so this is like a normal chair just we have kept it here these are the boxes which we got in while we were moving in from the other house and we have still kept it here so that it will be useful for us next time this is like a cleaning mop you know it the cleaning mop the cleaning bucket this is also cleaning equipments we have the wifi set up over here and we have like shoes of the other people who are living in the other room so this is like room number 1 and there's room number 2 over there and uh, this is one more uh, like a sitting setup so my like the room we used to in flat when used to sit here and like used to study is not here he went out somewhere so yeah this is like a set this is like a shoe stand i kept my boots my shoes and my heels over here these are the two tables like there's a cute story behind this two tables so what really happens here in usa so when people don't want their um, furniture so they just keep it out during um, like during what during during garbage day so we got this it was just round there at the corner and we can just pick up whatever we want so we bought this two chairs from there and we just took it like students usually do that they like take you have a lot of free stuff outside and there is this cart which we use for groceries because here um, if you have to go for groceries it's not it's not like in india where you just have your market beside it's like 20 minutes and 30 minutes walk so you can't like uh, like take all of the groceries by yourself and bring in so yeah so onion this is like the onion sacks if you take chota chota pack of onion it would cost you more so we usually offer the bigger one so this is like how much this is 5 kgs like 10 lb 5 kgs is like 10 dollars or something huh? so these are like um, two drawers of some furniture which again we got it from outside and i have used them as a container i've used them to keep all my utensils over here actually my utensils used to be some other side but then there's a rat problem in the house and it eats away all our uh, stuff so i kept the groceries here and i kept the other items inside the drawers this is just like a normal uh, plastic drawer set where i keep my noodles and my grains and everything like basically everything all the kitchen stuff the main kitchen stuff and then this is like a normal table where we keep all our food like the leftovers like after we cook after we eat so everything is right here this is like toaster and this is our mixer and here we have our fridge fridge comes in along with the apartment so it's not like in india that when you take uh, when you rent an apartment the apartment is empty so you get a fridge and you get some like you get in the restroom also you get drawers and you also get oven and you get this uh, gas with oven down as well fridge should be a kind of thing okay now coming to my favorite part that is the kitchen so we have uh, oven oven 
and like four gases over here and we have cabinets up there where we kept where we keep all our like grocery stuff so this is not mine this is like the other roommate so they have kept all their saman over here so there is one cabinet here there is a drawer here which is broken there is another drawer here where they have kept their rice and now to the best part that is something like that this is my stuff where I've tried keeping everything organized. So I kept my all my masalas over here, and I kept some of my dal, like my Nutella, baking powder, my oil, and some of the cutleries up there, which I don't use on daily basis. And then moving on, this is like my handy drawer where I kept some spoons, my chapati making that thing here, and I've kept a box. And this is my masala kadamba. Where I have masala in here, which is very, which comes very handy while cooking. So I was not that, uh, not very cooking person earlier in India, but after coming here, you have to do all by yourself. So I'm like a very good chef now. And there are spoons in here, so I kept my everything, all the spoons in here, which I use. So there's a mixer, which is not mine, but yeah, we use it. It's a mixer, bigger mixer. I have like a small mixer. So here in this part, I have kept my rice, um, wheat. There's like sugar. There's chai, coffee, and in that box there is pachadi. I will put it as in pickle. And then I've kept my ghee. I've kept another set of rice over here, and sugar, like karam powder, and all the basic stuff like basin, rava, uh, maida, and like dal. I've kept. All of these things inside because uh, all these things used to be outside earlier, but then we have this rat issue where rat eats away all of the stuff. So I kept all those in here. And I kept the like uh, utensils outside. So yeah, basically this is the thing. We also have a dishwasher which I never use. So this is like a dishwasher. Uh, the other room people uh, like keep their stuff here because we have less space in the cabinets. I never use a dishwasher is because one time that I used it in the other apartment, I put so much of liquid inside it and my my utensils were never that clean like how I clean it. So I basically try cleaning it with my, with my own hand. This is like the basin. We have tap over here. So it's like hot water and cold water. And to the best part, that's the view. So, so we can see the World Trade Center view from here. So it's like the World Trade Center over there. I'll just zoom in for you. Yeah, so beautiful. So I cook here every day. It's like a beautiful view. And to the left, we can also see Statue of Liberty, which is around there. Yeah, it's over there. I hope you can see that. So we have a very good view. This is like window number one and we have window number two over here where again the view is visible. I kept the dustbin over here so it becomes like handy like cooking and throwing on stuff in here. So we use the garbage bags inside that and also we have certain garbage days so it's not like uh, the garbage is full and you throw your garbage whenever you want so we don't have those dump yards here we have uh, vehicles coming in and picking up the garbage bags on certain days like for example on tuesdays and on fridays we have the garbage pickup and on sundays we have like plastic cardboards and all of those pickups so yeah so other than that this is like my best friend in the house so this is my mini portable washing machine because uh, I'm gonna make a video on that too where laundry doing laundry is such a big task in USA so laundromat for us laundromat is like five or uh, no 15 minutes away from here so taking all your uh, laundry and this is like a come here this is like a laundry bag so carry so this is like very choto laundry bag it's just the one week laundry so if you collect all the earlier before buying the washing machine we used to collect the laundry for like two weeks and then take up all this pile go to the laund laundromat do the laundry come back and it used to be so exhausting oh my god i, I don't know how to get started with that so that's why i came up to a solution where in new york and new jersey you um, can like get such portable washing machine it does not 
clean your clothes that much but yeah it does the job so i mean pretty it does your job pretty well so now after this we have our restroom over here before moving into our apartment we have the restroom here where we have a bathtub so this is like a curtain and in the we have shower in there it's like hot water cold water everything comes in and then this is like a basin this is our supplies so all the uh, whatever like cleaning supplies we keep the bleaching powder and other stuff like the um, laundry liquid and laundry washing uh, powder this is like drawer number 1 this is not my own over here that this is second one where i keep like my face wash my makeup cleanser razor like oil and like the bath stuff this is like one more thing where i keep my oil and there's a mirror in here which is a really kind of photo mirror but yeah so this like brush and all of the other supplies we keep in here moving on this is like everybody's shampoos and like bath um bath washing or whatever whatever liquids they use i don't use all those i just use a normal sunscreen soap which is right here i'm a very old school person so i don't use all this fancy stuff and for my hair also i don't use like fancy shampoo i just use one shampoo from like years now this these are the tissues and this is this thing did not come with a uh, with the house so we had to get this and yeah this just normal things this like this is like my getting i keep my chappals outside i don't get to get them inside so there's this light so this is my room which again is just giving like a overview of the room i start explaining this is my cupboard which we bought from marketplace we also bought this tv from marketplace so we like had an american couple so they had to sell off their tv and we bought it from there it was like a big task getting this stuff into like a big car but yeah eventually bought we bought it and this is like a small cabinet again we bought this also from marketplace where i keep my envelopes and all the letters and all the paper things over here this is like a cute thing which is just there other than that you better don't um, see what this is so this is like so this is like my messiest corner where i keep my creams my jewelry and everything which i need to like uh, it has been pending from like diwali where i haven't uh, cleaned all that part this is my mirror area this is like my favorite favorite part of my room this is a mirror i have which is like uh, a tripod we have a vase in there which i have not kept in the house because it gets dirtier so i haven't kept it i bought this uh, i bought this what i bought this sheet as well from like walmart i have this table so this like this is like a movable table which i use usually while i study so i have this chair so it's like the same color i bought the chair and the table both from marketplace this is window number 1 i have curtains over here i have the ac installed which is of no use during winters but moving on this is like my huge bed pillows bed sheet and all of this i usually keep this place clean because uh, i study here and i sit here i sit here i watch tv I like yeah so i sit here i relax i watch tv from here and uh, this is like my side table this is my side table i keep my stuff here i keep my books i keep my laptop so there and under the under the bed i keep my bags i have kept my bags and i've kept some like miscellaneous stuff um also then we have this door which i don't want to really open but like i can just give you a small glimpse so these are like all my clothes all my like undergarments and socks and everything i have all my clothes in here i have the mess down there which i don't want to show you so yeah so this is like a small closet uh, this is how the apartments are in new york and new jersey where you don't have like big closet area which is why uh, yeah so that's all that's all about the closet this is also one more fan fan number 2 huh. so this is like a movable fan uh so yeah so the difference in india and in here is we usually have installed fans up there at the ceiling but here people don't really follow the ceiling fans thing so they have like this portable fans like kept beside them or they usually have uh, acs installed in the house so i bought this fan from amazon and also there's like a small table which i eventually bought so that i can use that on like sitting on the bed and everything but i you don't use it for that and use it in the form of like a stand so yeah that's all so this is like my mirror 
where I usually get ready all the time. My mirror is very dirty and it gets dirtier all the time, no matter how much I clean it. I've kept all the clothes inside that. So, yeah. Also, there is cupboard number two, which is not mine. So, I've just kept it here because uh, we don't have space in the house. We have these water bottles. We don't drink the tap water. So this is like a small mandir place that I've made in the corner of the house. I light up the diyas over here and uh, yeah, I just sit here, pray sometimes. Yeah, so that was all about my home tour. So now what I'll do is I'll just quickly go down and show you my basement, how it looks like. So when I said there are two doors, so this is like door number one and we have the door number two over there. So yeah, so we can enter from there as well. So, so I'll quickly show you the basement where we used to have a washing machine, not like the other um, friends of mine. So what at their places they have the washing machine and the dryer in their building as well. But for us, it's not in like a working the condition. So that there are two ways to open the basement. One is through the building, and one is like when you go outside the building, there's one more door. But it's not accessible, you need a key for that. So, so this is the basement, which is scary. So yeah, that's all for the video you guys. I hope you liked it. It was like the most requested videos. When I made other videos, people asked me to um, give an accommodation tour and like a home tour. So I've given you my home tour. I've given you my room tour. 